Hello. Hey Commander Root. No, I'm not. I'm not doing anything right now. I'm trying to set up this uh, r Radeon Alive. Trying to set everything up so I can do a stream, hopefully later. Um, let me take a look at how the stream is going so far. Okay, stream looks like it's doing good. It's going great. Excellent bit rate. Better than OBS already so far. Global settings. Um, core desktop. Audio capture device. Camera. I'm gonna leave it as easy cam because I'm gonna play some banner of Banner Saga in a little bit. Maybe. I might play Banner Saga. I'm pretty bad at it. Could play Tacoma. Hmm. Hold up streaming. Show chat. Top right. Test the stream. See how it looks like. What it looks like when I type. Oh, well, that that is not readable at all. Hold up. Uh, font size medium. Oh, that's better. Hmm. And wait, can they see that? Okay, they can't see the chat. Okay, cool. 
Relive is pretty good so far. Okay. Okay. Is camera size okay? Yeah, it looks okay. Um, well, I don't quite. Wait, is that? Yeah, that's a black bar. I don't get that. Whatever, that works. Um. Let me get rid of the camera opacity, because that's kind of meh. Kind of weird. looking good. Well, it's looking better than it was a couple minutes ago. Now all I have to do is see about getting a light up here. Okay. Oh, that is way too bright. Um, shit. Ouch. It's hot. Try some. Oh, turn it off. Still too bright. Um. Maybe if I put like some over it, like. Not some thicker. Uh, no, too bright still. Um, oh, it doesn't even like to stay there, does it? No, it doesn't. dimmer light bulb, but I don't know what I'd, what I'd use. Um, and that light's no good. Um, let me see, if I turn off the light, how do I look? I don't look too bad. Okay, I can roll with that. Okay. Wait, if I do lights off that, that's ah, much better. Okay, so I'll stream with the lights off. Yeah, that works pretty good. Um, I think I'm gonna go back to having this be our mic again though. Stop it. Stop being confusing. Hmm. 
Messenger, there we go. Cool. Um, hold on, I'm curious. Hey, uh, welcome to the stream. Don't know who you are unless you say something, but hey, welcome. Okay, I'm a I'm just assuming the stream catches desktop audio. I'm gonna find out now. Okay, cool. I can actually do music. That sounds great. Um, cool. I can actually have music running in the background using like this. Okay. Now that I got that out of the way, music's way too loud though. Okay, that sounds good. That shouldn't be too loud over. Well, yeah, it's probably way too loud, but um, until I can figure out how to do audio settings more, no. Uh, oh, that's mic volume. Um, Okay, cool. I assume since it's recording desktop audio, if I set, like, this should be able to control that. So I got that under hand. Hey, guys. Uh, I'm not actually doing anything right now. I'm just setting up this new... Uh, I'm using... Oh, uh, what is this? Radeon ReLive is what I'm using right now. I'm just trying to get this set up so I can start doing future streams because OBS right now is not working. It's causing me lots of lag, and I want to test ReLive out, see if it does better on the lag end. Because I can't have you guys watching a stream that's like 10 FPS trying to play League. Which I'm not going to be playing League for a couple days. I just got a suspension. So, yeah, there's that. It looks like, so far, it's so good. Holy hell. GOG, calm the fuck down, bro. Get out of here. What are you doing? GOG, I love you, fam, but... Nah, get out of here. Okay, cool. So, Groove is taking up a nice chunk, so I might not do music. Not sure. Still learning, trying to see what I can get off with, get away with. Okay, Relive host application is only taking up 10% compared to like the 30, 40% the other was taken care of. Um, ooh. I'm not liking that though. What is causing that? Um, that is 
real life host application. Let me turn on the bitrate and see if that helps. Because the bitrate is pretty high for my standard. I mean, for what I usually use on OBS, that's really high. Okay, lower the stream the bitrate down to one. Streaming resolution down to 720, which is fine. Audio bitrate can stay at 64. Does that help at all? I have no clue. Um, oh, oops. Don't want to kill my system. Okay, let's see if that music is better now. Oh, you can't even hear it. Holy shit. Um. It's really quiet. Hold on, let me turn it up a bit. Not nearly to 100%, but like up so it can be heard. Okay, that's a nice, nice setting right there. I'll leave it at that. And that way I can listen to some music too while I'm at it. Okay, now that that's out of the way, we got cam, we got desktop audio, we got music going. I got the chat right in the top right that I can see and you guys can see. Um, I think that should be everything. I can actually do a stream now, but it won't be League of Legends, because I just got banned. But hey, that's fine. Um, what shall we play? Got some games in mind, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure if what I'll play. Um, got some Tacoma. I could try. Tempted to try Tacoma. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try Tacoma. Let me set up a Tacoma stream. And then I'll... Oh, I don't have my waiting screen, because I don't have, um... Crap. That's right, I can't do separate screen setups, because this is... Relive. Which is fine, I will... I'll figure something out. Yeah, we can set up a picture or something, and I'll just pull up, like, a picture on here while the music goes. Something like that. Hey, uh, welcome to the stream. Who is joining me today? Let me take a look. Welcome, slow cool, to the stream. Um, I'm going to be starting some Tacoma here in a minute. I'm just starting setting up the stream right now on Twitch's end, so I, I'm not just doing this. Yeah, give me just a minute, and I will change the stream to Tacoma, and then we will be playing that. I haven't actually played it. I watched, like, a little bit of footage from another YouTuber playing it, so it'll be a first reaction.
Twitch should be updated any moment now that we're doing a Tacoma stream. And the stream is looking tasty. Going strong, as far as I can tell. I wonder, is there anybody in the chat right now? Like, anybody here? Like, actually talking with me, or am I just alone here? Okay, but, uh, as soon as I start the game, I think I'm gonna turn off the music for the full experience. Because Tacoma looks like a fun game, and I really want to get the full feel of it. You know? Yeah. That's the plan. Okay. Welcome to the stream, guys. Okay. Let's make sure options are looking good. Translation's looking good. V-Sync off. Okay, hopefully graphics will be good, because I actually haven't even loaded this game before, so I have no idea what the graphics are like. Like, I know what the graphics are like, but I don't know what they're going to be like on my PC.
Okay, guys, I think we're gonna have a, a guest appearance by a friend of mine. Maybe. Hey, we got somebody. Hey, sorry about that. I was talking to somebody on Discord. Let me. Get Discord open, and I will have somebody else in the stream with me. Hey, uh, welcome to the stream. We're playing uh, Tacoma. Interesting menu. Black. Don't even know what's going to happen, but yeah. Subtitles. Back, controls, looks good. Discord open so I can get this person in here with me. <laughs> uh, hey, Ruru. This is the person that's going to be joining me today. Is uh, Little Bunny Ruru. Or just Ruru. Uh, waiting for Discord to open on my, on my PC here. I actually closed Discord because I wasn't sure if I wanted Discord to open while I was streaming. So I have it open my spare computer, which is also where I have Twitch open. So that way I can monitor the stream as I stream. Oh, and speaking of which, I'm going to turn off the music because we have a game going, or going to be going. Just waiting for Discord. Let me fix the audio, because the audio sounds a little loud. Sound. Master volume. Sound. I think voice volume pretty high. Sound volume down to like half. Let me see. Yeah, I don't know about you guys, but okay. That sounds nice. Yeah, that sounds nice. The mute, that's much better. Um, uh, I don't think this is a wrong type of taco. Okay, is Discord open? Let me see. No. Now it is. Okay. Uh, Ruru, where are you? Discord's being slow as hell. <laughs> uh, yeah, give me a sec, Ruru. I'll call you um, and get this stuff going. I would do it in just a regular chat, but I don't want anyone else joining in and just, you know, it'd get weird. Whoa, do we got other people in chat? No, that's just old, old stuff. Okay, never mind. Oh, stop it. Ch Discord, stop it. <laughs> You're drunk. Yeah, Discord's drunk. Oh, crap, I forgot to change Discord over to my other headset. Hold up, give me a second. I hear you through my other headset. I'm pretty sure they can hear you, but I can't. Hold up. Um, output device. There we go. Say something for me. I love this echo. I should turn the audio off on your stream. Oh, I, wait, I did? 
When did I do that? What? Hold up. I believe in you. Oh, Jesus. Wait, hold on. How many followers do you have? I have no idea. I wouldn't imagine that many. Also, you're breaking up like crazy. <laughs> I, I have like 28 last I checked. Let me check the audio on Discord and see what's going on. Give me a sec. No, everything sounds fine to me. Yeah, yeah, everything sounds great. Hey, Ru, are you here? Can you hear me? Hello? Oh, there you are. Okay, hello. Oh, wait, okay, audio, yay! Okay, is it working? Right. Good, everything's working. Uh, they should be able to hear you. Um, game volume is pretty okay. We got one other person in the chat. Okay, let's start this. Um, move the mic down a bit. Um, Here, I'm going to go plaster your name everywhere now <laughs> on all my active and inactive servers. Oh, dear God. I already tried doing that, and then I felt bad, so I stopped. Why? I literally have servers dedicated to streaming, servers with game chat, servers, mm, servers, servers like you. Okay, well, we're starting this, this uh, party. You wanna watch okay. me and a pal who wanna watch me and a pal. I have no life. I am the alien lady. Okay. Ooh, nice loading screen. It's got, like, a little moon going into, like, a... I guess it's an eclipse. Looks baller. But yeah, I saw this game on like Twitch Prime for uh, like the uh, free games they're giving away, so I picked it up, and I saw one of my the YouTubers I watch was playing it, and I only watched like the first like 20 minutes of the video, and I stopped because I remembered I already had this game. I'm like, wait, it's like I want to play this. So you should play it first. So yeah, so I stopped. Like I, I watched enough to know what the game is generally about in the beginning, and then I stopped because the game looks good. Like it looked good enough to to try and stream. I would record it, but recording takes a lot more processing power, and I highly doubt I could run this game with how pretty it looks while streaming. So you mean recording? I mean recording, yeah. I can get away with streaming on a lot of things compared to recording. Also, I got banned on League. Well, I didn't get banned. I got I got 14 day suspension because I called out a support that was diving, like two v one, 200 HP diving under turret like several times. And he was like, he was playing Pike, so he was like dashing into them two v one when he obviously knew I I wasn't gonna fight right then. It's like mm -hmm. I had low mana. It was a vein too, which was worse. It was a vein and a Alistair. So Ouch. But is it sad that I don't I'm genuine genuinely not surprised. Yeah. Knowing <laughs> Well thing is I don't I don't fully understand why I was banned. Uh, like I was I being I don't know either, but uh, well, thing you is... weren't the one to suffer no. in silence. It's like I tried being kinder to this support. Like, I was trying to give him, like, constructive feedback. Like, hey, can you not... Eventually, you like, lose your patience. Bah. Yes. Like, in the beginning, I was giving constructive feedback. I was being a little, a little more lenient. I was, like... Then later, like, You're I had the You're not like you used to be where you used to judge my support, Warwick, which is now completely acceptable. I, I still judge that. I will never stop judging it. You can judge it all you want, but when <laughs> I spoon feed all my ADCs now and... What's up with this loading screen now? It looks good, don't get me wrong, but... It's a beautiful loading screen, but it's a wild one. Yeah, it just... Yeah, it's taking a while. That's what I mean, like... Hmm. There's a face reveal chat? Where's the promotions chat? 
promotions. I don't care about me. Oh, God, oh. that's horrible. Um, <laughs> there used to be a promotions chat in this server, but is it gone now? Hmm. Base reveal, pictures and memes, pets, art. Yeah, it's, it's gone. Yeah, hey, Blood Rose. Hey, Mike's my site. <laughs> yeah. Um... Honestly, I'm not half surprised the loading screen. I might just have to turn down my graphics. Honestly, I, I'm just going with what the pre-selected like selected graphics are, which I'd assume it already scanned my comp computer to see what it thinks I can run. Hmm. So after uh, someone finishes their homework, um, they will hop into the stream. Hmm. What kind of homework are you doing? Well, first of all, it's not me. Oh. It's someone else who oh. will pop into the stream after they finish their homework. Mr. Myth. <laughs> no. No? Myth is offline. It is someone who joined a fandom server I'm a part of as of recently. Ah. Cool. Well, assuming this loading screen never ends, they might even join in when the gameplay starts. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> if they are lucky enough. Yeah. Not on the mod Rat you on. Dog Alleyway. Oh, I forgot this is a thing. I'm gonna mod you on um Twitch real quick. Uh, mod user. Okay. Well, the thing is, I have no real like moderators on my stream aside from like one other person, and I need to start getting like moderators that know what I want. You know. Okay. So. Keep all the sadistic assholes who make you feel like shit and ban the loop. I'm kidding. No, don't ban anyone. Just kind of like, if you're being a little. Oh, Ooh, it's starting. Ready to start docking sequence? What? It's oh, starting. That's new. That's new. Ooh, uh, don't open Amazon now. Ooh, take a look. This is cool. Ooh. I'm receiving Whoa. live online. Whoa. Uh, Whoa. Oh, Are you gonna read cool. or who? Evacuated. Fish, may I? Offline. I'm just gonna be quiet. Air supply. See, the sad thing is, is I can't hear the audio because or of the game because if I do that, I get an echo of you. Wait, you do? I just have to watch. How do you get an echo? Well, if I watch the stream. Oh, oh, yeah. You'd have to share a screen with me. I, no, yeah. I don't want to work either. <laughs> no audio, yeah. Could you deal with the echo? Like, could you, like, put it aside just to hear the audio? I could try, but it would probably give me a headache eventually. Yeah. I understand nice. if you stop eventually, but Thanks, at man. least try and listen to some of this, because the audio is beautiful. The music is going on, and there's actually good, like, voice acting for this. Like, for a small indie title, which, admittedly, this looks beautiful. Huh. Like, I'm not even using That's that high of graphics. hear the stream anyway. My computer doesn't like Twitch audio. Ah. I was thinking of streaming on YouTube, but I have more f uh, viewers on Twitch. And there's more people on Twitch See, in general. My my Twitch stream, or my Twitch channel, has the same amount of followers as my YouTube does subscribers. And the funny thing is, is both of them right now are both inactive. Oh, the... Wait, what's this? Play commentary. A, hey there, uh, I'm Steve. F I'm Carla. And we are the co-founders of Fulbright. Uh, oh, it's actually commentary from the developers. Tacoma's commentary mode. Welcome. <laughs> Throughout cool. the, the game, you'll find icons like this one um, that will give you insight from a bunch of different people that uh, contributed that to Tacoma. You know, people on the development team that did design, animation, sound, and pretty much uh, every other part of making a game like this a reality. Um, It'll be both uh, audio and sometimes visual. Um, yeah. Lots of information. Behind the scenes uh, concept art and other kind of development screenshots and stuff like that. And also on your way back out of this area, when you if you do a full playthrough of the game in commentary mode, there will be some new nodes that pop up in the hub and uh, in Amy's ship. So don't miss those. Thank you for playing through commentary mode, and we hope that you'll enjoy finding out more about how Tacoma was made. Okay, that's kind of cool. 
Oh yeah, Rue, just to help you out, I don't think I'll be talking a lot during the, like, the actual, like, noise, like, when they're actually talking and stuff. No, I know you won't. That's why I unmuted when, uh, you hit the commentary button, uh, thing. Yeah, like, I won't be talking when that happens. Like, I want to actually listen to this myself, so I don't want to hear myself talking while it's going on. Yeah. Also, okay. uh, don't, don't forget, I do have a little bit of a delay between the stream yeah, I know. and you actually talk. That is completely fine. I understand that completely when I invited you to come join me. But just having Sit someone to run. talk to that can see mostly of what's happening is nice, you know? I think I'm going to skip most of these commentary buttons, but it is nice to know it's here, you know? Like, I like the idea of what it is, but I'm going to just play mostly for the gameplay, then... Oh. Yeah. How small is this in Indica? Oh, okay. Hi. What? Amy? Amy. Oh, yeah, this and, that's and our start... character. Our character is Amy. Oh, Install yeah. AI oh, netware here. Now. Can I do anything with this? No, I cannot. Okay, well... Speaking of female protagonists, did you know that Samus being a chick was a last-second thought? Hmm. It was, they had time before the release, so at the end of the game that Samus is in, which I can't remember because I never play it. Yeah. <laughs> they made a chick model and used it. Ooh, hub. Movement in zero gravity, zero G basketball, hub's aesthetic design... I like zero G. Hold on. Wait, are these the like uh zero G basketball? I know. I I don't think these are enableable. I just think these are things you can do. And it checks off things you've done cuz that was the welcome. I know you would um could, but right now I rather just have use one the person. Zero G basketball piece. I actually don't know where that is. I've like I said I only watched like 10 minutes of the stream. And then I went through. Mini, I'm headed in. So yeah, I'd rather have like a no, gamer talking to me while I play this instead of like, like, no, you're wrong. I'd love to have you blood, but um, I just rather have a gaming friend, I guess. Yeah, makes sense. Cause Ruru games, Ruru sucks at every video <laughs> game, but she games. Yeah. She knows gaming terms, and it won't be confusing to talk to someone that actually plays games. Since there doesn't even know what video game Samus is from. Oh, well, I don't really either, so don't feel bad. Okay, I did see this. So you got open this, and then you gotta take these. This is like virtual reality, where you wear this and you get to see shit. <gasps> Yay! Except it's you like... You bend over to look in it. No, no, look. Look. Oh, is it like contacts? No, no, you put them in behind your, your earlobes and it attaches to like your neural network. And then look. Oh god, that's, that's, that's... Like, Venturous Technologies, Aros Initializing, Augmented Reality Operating System. Look at that. Hello, hmm. I am Odin, Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma's Operational Data Interface Network. I have recorded this message to welcome you. So this is a yes, horror game aboard. though? I'm not sure. Before I can set up your station profile, you must register your oh, no, it is beautiful. Honestly, the idea of this has like a horrorish thought AR to me because I'm so used to playing games like uh, Aliens, Isolation, in these spaceships where everything goes terribly wrong, you know? Like, Unlike so... Unlike me, who has a low budget and low computer speed. Oh, well, like, my I computer is no, like... Person. My computer is no, like, no, like, gaming, but gaming, at least but... you can run, if you can run this game and stream at the same time, your computer is better than mine. In okay. fact, if you can run this game, in fact, if you can run Minecraft on your computer, your computer is better than mine. <laughs> okay, hold on, I'm gonna read this. Okay, by entering Venturis facility, you can send to the following. This facility uses augmented reality body positional tracking for a multiple eh, eh, a multitude of critical functions. Visitor body positional data as well as audio and visual data may be retained by Venturist Technologies and its subsidiaries to better ensure the highest level of security and service. By entering this facility, you relinquish all rights to any data collected by the augmented reality system and release Venturis from any future liability for its retention or use in perpetuity. 
<laughs> We're I evil. I recommend that Amy doesn't <laughs> touch it and walks back to that comfy little chair she was in a moment ago. Oh, I, I fully sympathize, but we gotta do it. We gotta go inside. But can't we just take the Boop. blue pill and end the dream? No, we're booping. We're booping its hands together. Look at this. Whee! We're so well, happy. What positional data has been registered <laughs> with Tacoma's AR network? Whee! Please sign in. I love how you didn't identity. catch that reference, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, hold up. What's this? Take, take, take the blue. I know that. No, I know that reference. I, I just didn't want to comment on it. Okay. By signing here, you... Contractor, confirm that you shall abide by the conditions of your contracting agreement, including in respect to all data, data privacy rights of insurance technologies and its subsidiaries. You need to fucking not sign it, Amy. Don't you know this is how every horror game I know. That's why I think this is a horror game. In perpetuity, through through the universe. All data on this Venturus facility is to be considered of strictest confidentiality and by signing here you acknowledge that to access or transmit any confidential data belonging to Venturus constitutes a felony violation of orbital law which you and all your actions are subject. Sign and then I gotta sign. And um, you know the Oh my god look at, look at the hand symbol she makes for this stuff. Thank you. I got wait. You missed. Yeah, but look at this. Look at the wacky like hand symbol she does. Oh, she uses sign language. Yeah. All activity yeah. Sole property that was of the cool. I think she's. Any questions about? I, I don't know what it's called. I think it's. Oh. Whoa. Odin. Whoa. You okay there, man? No, like, like wait for it. Odin, like, oof. I don't know what was going on with him. Is he glitching out? Mm-hmm. Oh, God, no, it is a horror game. Fuck! It has to be, like... Like... Okay, um... Recoverable AR data found entering data recovery mode. We got drink bags. We got... Hold on, what's this? Amy is fallen subject to the classic video game Sickness scam bag. of... Oh, nothing bad can happen from signing the contract. Ooh, this way to the K Tacoma Dome. That sounds nice. Oh, what's this? Does the bag have tacos in it? Actually, no, it's a sickness bag. I don't think you want to eat anything out of that bag. I want tacos. I came here for Ooh. the tacos, sir. Ooh, long tea bag. This looks fancy. Access denied. Whoa. See, is, I'm still... Is that a robot? I know, I'm like... Don't worry about it. Like, I know you're behind me. Whoa. Blue team, red team. Scoreboard. What is this? Did you find basketball? I It has. This has to be. I did find basketball. But how do I play? <gasps> basketball. I want to play the basketball. I actually have no idea how to play this, but where's the ball? Oh, here's the ball. I found the ball. Hold up. Right there. He's upside down. I, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to find the ball because it keeps spinning with the room. Oh, that was a fail. I think the ball's centered in the middle. Oh, no, I, I already grabbed it, but, like, uh... This is so trippy, because you're... I'm trying to look around, and it's, like, glitching out, because I'm, like... I gotta remember the rotation of the room, plus, like... <laughs> like, just watch me derpily try and grab this basketball and score a hoop just to get this achievement. I guess it's an achievement, I don't know. Oh, let me just slam Dude, dunk it. just, like, walk up to the basket and throw it. Oh, dunk! <laughs> That's how you actually dunk. do it, is you dunk it. Wait, did I do it? It's a zero G basketball, but dunk. Yeah. Going for the dunk. Dunk, 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 dunk. Yeah. I did it. <laughs> okay, I'm out of here. Uh okay, where was I going? Uh far away. That's docking, so That's I need the to go. Ultimate this way. basketball court though. Oh yeah, while well, like, it's spinning. Up next level to Rocket League soccer. Ooh, Zero AR G desktop. Basketball. Whoa, hold up. Let me go to uh, options and let me increase the resolution because this is so trippy trying to look at this tiny like screen, like tiny window. For me, it's like a lot smaller and it looks weird. All right, all right. I'll let you know if it. Uh, and FOV needs to go up. Oh yeah, FOV needs to go way up. 
Let's go to 336. Oh, that is way better. That is way, way better. Okay, this looks way better. Okay. Emity so what does FOV stand for? Oh, Field of Vision. Field of Vision. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, and here's our license. Oh, the thing that makes my computer die. Got it. Wait, Field of Vision doesn't kill your computer. For me, it does. It oh. kills it, because now it has to render more. Um, I think, uh, you might want to... I'm not sure if it's cutting out in the stream or not. Oh, is it? But it's taking out the, uh, full thing now. Yeah, that's what I did. I fixed it so that way it's full screen. Okay. Because I didn't like it being so small. Okay. Sign out of Tacomas. Tacomas. That just sounds like... Tacoma. I think it's... I think it's Tacoma is how it's been pronounced by several people. I don't care. It's Tacomas. Please proceed the to... Tacos. The personal module to begin the AI transfer process. Your progress will be tracked. That's not creepy. Oh, this is the map. Oh. Hello. Well. Is this like... I came for the tacos. This is not tacos. I'm, I'm sorry. There's no tacos yet. I'll have to get to the uh, area. Oh, here's the crew roster. Um, okay. Crew of Lunar Transfer Station... Tacoma evacuated. Subcontractor shall board Tacoma, which is me. Proceed to data access points in each habitable section. Transfer AI data from station to subcontractor vessel. Retrieve AI central processing network. Wet work. Return intact AI to Venturus. Subcontractor exceed, agrees to provide data transfer hardware and transport vehicle. Subcontractor verifies transport vessel is capable of supporting Obsidian class artificial intelligence, which will be Odin. So, pretty much, we're just data recovery here. Okay. Ah. And here is our the crew that left. That is E.V. St. James, Clive you know Siddiqui. What, what? You know what that means? That means that Amy just fucked up her entire career choices by joining this place. Probably. <laughs> and signing that contract. Okay, here's Natalie Kershenko. Roberta Williams, Sarah Hasmati, and Andrew Dagyab. I like Sarah and Natalie. 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 Uh, Natalie. I Natalie. Um, Natalie. I can't read. Okay, Evie is the station administrator. Mr. Siddiqui is the operations specialist. Okay, so there's Please. a botanist, which means this must be in space. Shit, I thought it was <clears throat> fence. Oh, wait, what was that? Hold up. What's this? Oh, that's like another clothes thing. Okay, so let me just continue on. Okay, so this is personnel. Personal access. Initiate transfer. Oh, so this is how we get around. We grab onto these things, and then we go... All the way down. Okay, so I'm going to the personal area now. Whoa, that's nice. Hey, you got three viewers now. Yeah, welcome to the stream, Tacoma. guys. Tacoma, Tacoma. I came for the tacos and a fantasy video game. I was fucking lied to. <laughs> uh, hey, welcome to the stream uh, where we play Tacoma and talk to uh, this crazy person here. A fucking gecko <laughs> up in the corner of the room. <laughs> Hello! And they left before. Are we late for tea? Excuse me, no. Not the March Hare. The White <laughs> Rabbit. <or> fucking Jackula. <laughs> I am the rejected cousin of the two of them. Oh, dear. That was too wacky even for the insane Alice. This is a point. pretty sick loading screen, if you ask me. Like, for a loading screen, I this is... But like, I'm just watching her go down and... Yeah, lying. I'm guessing this is a loading yeah. screen. No, like, see how this acts? This looks like a loading screen. Yeah. Except, like, an animated loading screen, really, like... Those are always nice. Oh, yeah. Like, look, red ring. Wait for it. Jeez. Red ring. See, it's 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 a loop. It's really a loop. It's a loading screen. If you, it's like... It's a loading loop. Yeah. Not to mention the pipes uh, repeat, and you can I see the. I just realized I should have invited Puppy. 
Well, go ahead. Honestly, the loop is kind of obvious. The loop is beautiful. Oh yeah, like the the looping they use is pretty nice. It's almost hard to tell until you just see it like three or four times and you're like, wait, oh, it's a loop. You gotta wait for it. Wait for it. Okay, there, it's a loop. Yeah. I'm guessing it's a this loop is between how the red all rings. all great gifts start. Oh yeah. What? I'm guessing the loop is between the red rings because that's like the one constant. The most notable point. Yeah. It's the one well, thing that stands out. Well, I mean, it's out. a loop. It's an all constant. Yeah, yeah. But it just makes sense that after the red loop, it loops right there, because then it respawns at the bottom of my feet. Like, if I watch right at the bottom, it shows up at the bottom of the feet after it passes. So the red ring would be the most make the most sense for a loop. Well, it is kind of more noticeable as well with the lag, because it has a oh. slight delay. Yeah. Or the lag delay, I can see it stop and regroup and loop. Mm -hmm. Like, don't get me wrong, I can tell my PC is kind of lagging here a little bit. Well, no, it's also my access to the stream. Oh, yeah. That too. Because I got a shitty computer and I can't even play Minecraft. Like I said, what I, I do like about this blocks. is I like I can open up the tab menu and I can look at my emails as I'm, like, traveling. The loading screen. Yeah, like, look, I can do things. This is the longest elevator shaft. No wonder why they had to be evacuated. <laughs> I know, right? Well, if actually... If anything went wrong, they would try to escape via the elevator shaft. Well, while we're doing this, I can get to look at the uh, crew members. Are you sure we're not on Earth yet by this point? Oh, I know, right? Um... But hey, it is a clever way to hide a load screen. Yeah, like, this is a great way to do it. Of course, for faster computers, you wouldn't even notice it. It would be a really fast in and out, and you wouldn't even know it's a loading screen, but for slower computers, you start noticing it. Yeah. Okay, so that's Sadiki. This guy looks pretty pretty dapper, don't you say? Purple shirt. Sadiki doesn't look dapper. Sadiki <laughs> looks sadistic. Oh, come on. You don't have to be mean to my, my, my dude. He's no, you no, no. Natalia is the best person. Look at that creepy hassle smile. Oh Jesus, no, no. This is the hassle smile. Like, look at that. Pure hustler wait, wait, right wait. there. Pure hustler. Who's the hustler. This one. Can we just yeah. open up the? Can we just open up Andrew really? Oh God, she's creepy. Can we open up Andrew? Can I actually can't look over to him. Robert. Oh, it's a ruby. For... You can't. You can't touch. No. Uh, um... Asian dude thing is my Asian this is the video. edge of my this is the edge of my view i can't go any farther to the right so i can't select it Aww, huh. but Andrew let me try this yeah no i can't look any farther to the right i'm stuck against the wall you can get you know the only normal ish person on that thing that looks normal ish would be Chris. i would say <laughs> james yeah james look nor looks normal james doesn't look normal James look like he's hard. She, the, the she. Sister. That's a she. That's yeah. Evie St. James. Oh, you just said James. I no. thought you were talking about the dude next. To James. No, Evie St. James. Oh, okay. Yeah, she looks the most normal. Okay. Looks the most sincere. Sarah she doesn't looks look bad. like. Sarah doesn't look she too bad. She reminds me of Miss Pat. From. Miss Pat was my daycare. Oh, dear person. God. <laughs> like, when you see, like, someone you knew as a child in a game, you're like, what the hell are you doing here? Get out. <laughs> you're like, no! You need to stop! <laughs> like, it was funny. I found the phone number to the youth center, which is still up, because it's privately owned by Miss Pat. And I called Miss Pat, and I went, hi, this is Savannah. And she goes, say ya? And I go, fuck! <laughs> oh my god. Say is my last name. And she just like, wait, oh. wait, you sent her like adopt, like a orphanage or? No, it was a daycare center. Oh. It was okay. the place you went to after and before school. When you were a oh. military base. Oh, I actually didn't know that was military base. Thing is, I was stuck in daycares until I was like 11. 
because my mother would not let me stay at home, even though I showed multiple times I I was better at home on my own. <laughs> nah, we gotta go by Sinma's logic. You can't leave to work unless you have a babysitter. Do you want to stay or hire a babysitter? No, the thing is, we didn't hire a babysitter. She sent me to their house, and it was like, you yeah, know those I types know. of babysitters. I hated it. Like Oh, those, like... Quote unquote daycares, but they're just a glorified babysitter with yes. kids in their home. Yes. Yeah, no. This wasn't a privately owned one of those. This was a. Oh, here we are. Here we are. Now entering personnel module. Holy cow. Yay. And look, here's the bottom of the loop. Look at this. Look at this. I will look up and it won't even be that long. Hold up. Oh, it closes on you so you can't see. Aw, oh, smart oh, developers. No. Very smart Don't developers. You just hate it when you can't pull that off? Yeah. Hold up. Very smart developers. Okay. Subcontractor Farrier. The company has remotely disabled the station's AI ability to directly affect operations on Tacoma. Or contact you via the station's AR net. Any attempt to communicate with the AI is strictly prohibited. Oh, this is so, so AI gone killing spree. Aww. Like, Maybe how is this not? You need to make better life choices. Like, how is this not? Like, tell me, that does not sound like he's going to try and kill us if we talk to him. Is it like male GLaDOS? Kind of. He doesn't actually sound that bad from what we saw from the intro. But, um, yeah. Also, look. SPACE! Where is space? Wait, I'm waiting. Wait, yeah, wait for it. Waiting because I've got the stream lag. I've got to wait for it to catch up. Also, with the lower graphics, you can actually tell that the space is just a picture they have set on rotate, and it's connected <laughs> to, like, the outer rings of the picture of the space station. I see the hats. It's very clever how they did it, so on higher graphics, it'll look like actual space. But with the, the fast rotation, you notice things like this. I like how they did so it, though. So does this... Yeah. It does look nice. So... Unlock sun. Well, I'm calling it sun, even though it's literally like a spot of light that they're using rays cast on to look like the sun. Or a sun, or whatever. A a ball of fire in the, sky, in the, in the space that's making a sun look, you know? Isn't the sun. In fact, did you know that suns aren't actually on fire? It's all nuclear radiation. Yep. I do know that. Thank you, Sai. Thank you, documentaries. Also, with See, low graphics. This is why I'm not a normal child. Yeah. I watch documentaries and shit. I do too. But like with low graphics, well, this is still high graphics, but I have like a lot of things that would make this a lot prettier turned off. Mm -hmm. It still looks nice nonetheless, but. I can still see things that normally people wouldn't notice. Hold on, attention. Yeah. Subcontractor Farrier. Oh, here's the data panel that we have to access. Woo, don't touch the AI button. Now we put our booklet here. That little, like, tech book that we ripped out of our ship. Yep, slap it here. Boop, 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 boop. Why did we rip a book off of our ship? Why was a book glued onto the ship? To well, it's not glued. It's like magnets. It's like magnets no, that I, hold I, it in. I, 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 I know. It's a joke. It's going to take a while for the first part of the AI net to go up. This is no simple t file transfer. Okay. All up. Okay, we, we can send you secure messages through the interface, but it's a one-way connection. We will be monitoring the situation from here. Okay, I don't like this already. You're telling me that this is a one-way connection, meaning I can't... Oh, hell no. Get me the hell off this rock. <laughs> well, it's not a rock. It's a pretty nice this space This isn't even a rock. This is a metal hula hoop. Well, it's set... Oh, that's dark. That is very dark in there. I don't like that. Um, yeah. What's dark? Wait, I'm waiting. Uh, Stream, hurry up. I'm sorry. It's like... It's Twitch's, like, automatic delay, you know? That's dark. The administration. Okay, it's nobody's here, of course. Is this like 
Five Nights at Freddy's Three Dimensions. Oh, Whoa. wait, no, I see what it is. That's Windows to the outside. Recoverable AR data. Hold space to recover. Well, press space. Yeah, she's using sign language to uh, control things. That's cool. That's smart. Why is the screen staticky? Ooh, oh, it's because weird. we're recovering AR data. Yearly report to Ventura's Corporation, take three. Uh, Odin, have you got me? I am prepared. Okay. I'll just, uh... Death? Wait, I up. saw that. Whoa. Oh, yeah, this is what I saw I when saw, I did watch the I saw the, the word there. death. I, I saw the word death. <laughs> I saw the word death. Ooh. Okay, so we just recovered her data pad, and now we're looking at what we can. Okay, right, hold on. Let's let's slow down. Have you caught up to where I'm at? I'm I'm seeing um. You're looking at things. Data pad. Some of yeah. The, yeah. The data this pad. is uh, this Evie is St. James. Thing. This is Evie, Evie St. James data pad. Yes. Okay. Okay. First so message. I'm Evie and it says hi there. Evie St. James here. Okay. So, Corporate report right. script. Remember positivity, body language, enthusiasm is what I think that means. Hi there, E.B. St. James here, administrator of Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma. It has been a year now since... <laughs> hasn't it, Odin? <laughs> and then a whole bunch of gibberish. Our proudest moment as a crew. Okay, that sounds pretty nice. Next message. Why does this look like a uh, wingding? Or something close to it? Um, or just a bunch of money symbols? I don't know. It looks oh, like I think it's like... Uh, Oh, I can't remember what the text is called. But it's a bunch of gibberish, like, corrupted text, you know? Well, yeah, well, it's corrupted text, but it is something I believe you could put on a document. Wingdings. Like, yeah, wingdings. It looks like wingdings, like kinda. Like one of wingdings font. It is. Oh, uh, wait, I see some Asian letters. Uh, no, it's wingdings. It has to be wingdings. Yeah, it looks like wingdings, because I remember that from, uh, um, watching the uh what game is that with the sands and uh undertale undertale theories. undertale theories from back when um matt pat was doing undertale theories on comic sands and like what that one guy was Gaster. wingding gaster yeah what his text was and he found out his wingdings that's why i remember from okay let's get back to the game okay from andrew dagia <laughs> Undertale forever. <laughs> Re, just ch don't even know what that says. Okay. Hey, Andrew, I have the to get this report done before end of day. Can you get this ready for the party? I'm having one of those days. Thanks, from Odin. As requested, I have prepared instructions for a champagne cocktail. Okay, sounds pretty useless, but... Okay, 12-ounce sleeves of campaign. champagne. Okay, let's recover another message. Let's see what we got. Failed. Okay, so we can't recover that. Restoring. Oh. Hello. What's happening? I'm waiting. Oh, just I'm gonna wait for you to catch up and let you look at this at oh, the same time. Oh, it failed. What? Why did it fail? I don't know. But uh, Cascadia FN Manufacturers Union brings new suit over deaths of workers at Tacoma, where we're at. W A plant. Union City's new evidence, the legal battle ongoing for over five years now. One key fact in this dispute has never been denied. Deaths of two, 322 workers, gibberish, caused by exposure to dangerous chemicals during the production of gibberish. How much the plant's management knew about the danger to workers and when has been at the heart of the conflict. Today, a new law lawsuit citing newly uncovered evidence that plant management has been long been aware of the dangers to workers and failed to change their practices in time to prevent the deaths. That doesn't sound good. I don't know about you, but that does not sound good. This place has to be run by oh. something evil. Okay, this whole part, I've already seen how this goes and how to do it. And from what I understand, you can, like, if you want to learn more about the, the story... You can follow these guys around and listen to their conversations. And as the story unfolds, you like at the bottom of the bar here, 
it shows these question marks. Those question marks are different tablets we can learn about and we can review. Yeah. So like all those guys over there, we can look at certain points in time and one of them has their tablet open, we can recover it and look at what they were looking at. Now for this, I actually don't know what the password is. I gotta wait for her to open it and I gotta watch the password. Or wait, is the password here? I don't remember. Um, tell crew good news, answer any questions about posting exertions. Door request. It's on the back, maybe? No. No password here. Wait, so does Apple own this, and is this their failed re- is this them trying to triumph their Pippin? I don't think this is anything about Apple. I think Apple owns the space station. They epically failed with the Pippin, oh, and now they're trying to get- Oh! Hold up! Them it's a house cat! Pippin. Whoa. It's a house cat. Where's the house cat? Just wait. Where? Look! House Waiting! Cat. <laughs> it's a house cat! Give me the cat. Sadly, Where's my cat? Oh, there's nothing right I can do. I <laughs> I'm gonna grab my cat. Where are you? Whoa. Oh, this is cool. Mother. Replace our showerhead. Shipment rescheduling. Oh, what's this say? Okay, okay I'm back. I got my cat. Okay, Odin Monthly Solar Panel Audit Report. Okay, I'm just looking at the uh, thing here. Okay, so... Okay, so let's continue. I, the... I seriously did get up and grab my cat, by the way. Oh, nice. Well, I'm going to be quiet again, because I'm going to restart the audio here, or the error, or, like, see what was going on here. Okay, <clears throat> let me go ahead and... Hi there, Ryan. Evie St. James here, Administrator of Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma. It's been a year now since our crew has cycled onto the station, meaning we've had a year of getting to know each other, getting acclimated to the facility, and getting used to working with our on-station AI. Though working with Odin's been great, hasn't it, Odin? Yes. Auto drone deliveries to and from the Zenith Lunar Resort have improved in efficiency by almost 4%. So, most of that is thanks to Odin finding some improvements we could make. Uh, ah, our proudest moment as a crew, I think, was when a resort guest needed emergency care while on a transit vessel and was brought aboard Tacoma to be stabilized in one of our medical stasis cryo beds until she could. Evie, we're about to cut the cake. Ah, thanks. Um, be right there. Odin? We'll get back to this after the party, okay? Of course. One, two, eight. Wait. One, two, two, eight was the password for this. I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, another big thing about this is when they're opening doors and passcodes like this, you can watch them put it in, and you can, like, open doors if they've opened them just by typing the password. And this allows you to follow, like, say, there's other things going on over there that I could be listening to, and I could have gotten the other data pad, but instead, I'm going to learn more about what she's talking about, and we can look inside this room, because we followed her. And we looked at the password. She has a nice little bedroom. Oh, this isn't a bedroom, this is her office. She's the, uh, uh, what is she again? Let me look at the thing. She is the station administrator, so she's like the boss here. She still has a nice room of her own. Yeah. Ooh, nice music, too. Madame. It's uh, the soothing sounds of Ventura's radio. That's nice. Are you not happy in my arms? I can hear your cat. <laughs> Whoa, what? Whoa. It is glitchy. Oh yeah, things got a little glitchy. Hold on, what, what's this all about? The Aventurous Belt. Expand. Let's see what this is about. The work, future of hospitality in space, a homework, a network of 1,000 orbital vacation homes. Ooh. That sounds actually quite nice. Yeah, it does. Yeah, let's see what else the rest of this is. Oh. Whoa. Why didn't we know about this? Status alert. Status gibberish. 
The following orbital conditions warning is in effect from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. SGT. The station's orbit will coincide with a field of increased asteroid activity and orbital debris. Impact preparedness level will be increased from green to yellow during this time. Crew should be continue with normal operations, but gibberish. So we already know. Can we? Hmm? Gibberish. Yeah. I'm... A contract and glitching. Fucking horror. Yeah. Amy needs better life choices. I know. Like this screams horror to me. Hold on. What's this? Okay, from Venturis. Operational logistics. Odin. No, that's not Odin. That's uh, that's Venturis. That's from the company. Okay. Upon oh. your review for your request for network specialist access to the Odin's unit operational hardware has been summarily denied. We refer you to corporate regulation article VT eight six A one. 76MU or dash MU086, which clearly restricts all access to AR hardware from contracting crew. As this is the third time a request of this nature has been made by Tacoma, under your supervision, your contractor dossier has been marked with an additional disciplinary flag, totaling two on your account. Please remember, one more disciplinary flag will trigger an overall contractor viability review. Venturis. Oh dear, that's not good. So, I'm guessing someone here wants access to Odin? Hmm. Which can't be good. Oh, and here's her license, which I'm not even going to really look at. Um, okay, let's, let's follow her out. Let's open the door and then watch her leave. Oh, she ran out. Well, let me pause it again. Where did she go? She went over here. Oh, everything is glitchy. So there's no oxygen on the station except what we're breathing right now. Correct. Oh dear. Right, I'm we should have about 48 hours of breathable air, maybe more, if Odin's readings are correct. All right, I'll have VT send up a fresh supply straight away. Guys, it might not be that easy. Additionally, external communications have been lost. So we've got no air supply, no external comms, no way to call for help. Well, anybody got any bright ideas? And that is the end of that. Now I'm going to rewind yeah. and go through with the other people, like see what they were doing up until this, but... Okay, tell me when, you, when you've when you caught up, like when everything's over. Yeah, I caught up. Okay. I caught up. From this, from what I can tell, shit hit the fan. Meteors hit the station, they lost contact with the outside, they lost, they're losing oxygen quickly. Oof. This sounds like every space tragedy. <laughs> tragedy. This sounds like the most, like, stereotypical space tragedy ever. Am I right? Can we get something new, like a giant alien squid? Oh, fuck. Never mind. That's Don't even ask, because that might even happen. Okay, hold on. I'm going to rewind all the way back to... It would be better if the Statue of Liberty sucked up all the oxygen, because at least only one movie has done that so far. Okay, let me see which one the second mark is, and then let me follow them from the start. Okay, this is the gears. Who has gears? Is that... That's back here. Okay, let's follow this guy now. Now, I, from what I can tell, the game is all about repetition, like watching these over from everyone's point of view and learning things, because I did watch this first section where he did everything, and that's where I quit, is after this. And from what I understand is there's so many ways to view each situation. Like, you could just easily just look at one and then stop at each, like, data tablet and just read through them real quick for data but there's so much hidden so much like lore hidden in these in listening to these guys like so far what we've collected is that they are gathered here for the celebration but we don't know why they're here for happy obsolescence day now what's obsolescence day you want to know how you learn what obsolescence day is 
you go through the fucking routine. Yep, you gotta listen to these guys, and they will actually like say it. So I'm gonna go all the way back, and I'm just gonna stick near this guy. So the name Kitchen Obsolescence Day. day. Slash like a joke. Slash <laughs> you could say it's facetious, Kai. You probably think I'm an idiot for no reason thinking cooking. about why. It's That's all we know. Out of curiosity, why did you think we were celebrating? I thought maybe it was it up, when yeah. some old type of AI you know, had become obsolete. But well, I guess that doesn't make sense. <laughs> yes. Uh, no, um, AI aren't like designer hardware. Uh, as soon as oh, the new shit. model's out, we trade in the old one for customer loyalty. AI are more like um, mighty redwoods. Ancient organisms growing and adapting year after year, decade after decade. How do you think this looks? Huh. Um... Okay, let's stop right there. What we just learned is that obsolescence day sounds like it's like it's celebrating Odin, really, is what it sounds like. Hmm. Like it's celebrating the AI. Because as they said, that AI used to be traded in for loyalty points. Now, hardware is not like that. They're like redwoods, as he said. As we all know, redwoods are grow to be ancient like huge so that has to imply that our this obsolescence has something to do with the ai now i'm going to take a look at this guy's uh tablet and then go through that real quick okay is it his birthday no no it's they're making a cake for the party no i mean is it the ai's birthday it could be though that's what we haven't learned yet we haven't learned why this is here why we're having obsolescence day but it could be it could very much be that okay divide the finishing ice finished icing into batches of that please apply vibrant red liquid food coloring found in bin whatever in cargo hold please write the tacoma crew should feel proud of their accomplishments so is this, is this like a like an accomplishment party like did, like, Odin learn his last bit and graduated high school? <laughs> I have no idea. But, like, from the sounds of it, this is a mixed party for something to celebrate Odin and to celebrate the crew's achievements. Which sounds nice. Okay, so they get cake. I think they were their high school teachers. What do you mean? I mean, Odin is a student, and each of them are the period class. I, I don't get that. I don't, I don't think so, because they're just working here. Okay, so, no, I know. from well, Jermaine Burgess, re, I've entered voice range. Hey man, I was talking to you yesterday over AR. There's something I've been thinking about since. I know you and EV, that's the Sir, the Jamie, James over there that we talked, that we looked at first, mm -hmm. have been getting serious. So wait, this guy and James are dating. Okay, so, yeah, from the sounds of it, this guy and James are dating. Okay, so I wouldn't be a good friend if I didn't say I think this relationship with Evie is not good for you, man. I think you might be getting taken advantage of again. I'm sympathetic, and I've had my share of things that have started on a long-haul posting. There's only so many people on board, and I get that Evie is dealing with some special circumstances. I do. Grief is mysterious. Whoa, whoa, grief. Does that mean there's something going wrong with Evie? Especially with being it being her sister. That changes things. Take a step back, at least for now. Not every relationship has to be a forever thing. Okay, that's telling me something already, that Evie has something going on. Oh, this is Clive Siddiqui. That's that, that uh, Asian-looking dude. Or not Asian. That's, a, that's that, uh... That, uh... The dude next to her with the creepy smile. Yeah, the one that you didn't like that much. The, uh, like, uh, Iraqi yeah, guy. I guess he looks kind of Iraqi, I guess. Like a really tanned Iraqi guy. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Don't I want to be racist. I can't really say don't want to be racist, but yeah. No. Well. Okay, so no, that's... No, I can't say it because I'm not familiar with what they look like. Oh. Well, I'm not saying because I don't want to be racist, but that's like the closest comparison. Okay, that was all I saw in this tablet that I could recover. So I'm just going to play this through and just watch. Up until the point where they all converge, because we already saw that. Okay. This is what Odin wanted? Odin, uh, this is what you wanted, isn't it? 
That is a fairly accurate representation of my instruction. See? He loves it. Thank you, Odin. That'll be all. Yeah, but we're the ones who have to eat it. Well then, no need to keep the good people waiting, eh? Evie, we're about to cut the cake. Okay, this is where she went into her office, if I remember correctly, and she cut that off, and then things went wrong. So, is there any conversation that happens here? Let's see, and then if not, I'll rewind and I'll follow someone else. Here it is. Odin's masterpiece. Sarah, come on up. It's ready. Gather round, gather round, everyone. She's in her As office. Per obsolescence day tradition, tonight's festivities have been planned entirely Probably by our all-knowing, all-seeing all -seeing computer, computer companion. companion. I want to stop that there. He provided specifications for the... Oh, hold on. A little bit more. Cake, uh, the decor, we humans only did the grunt work in his grand plan. And so for your enjoyment tonight... Oh! Oh! Whoa, what the hell was that? Okay. What was that? My face went crazy. That was crazy. Hold on, let me rewind that. Hold up. Oh, that's funny. It does like the squeaky voice when you rewind. He did the grunt work in his grand plan. <laughs> okay, that is creepy. They are like acting like this guy is a as their AI is a god. Like their AI does everything. I'm not liking that. That gives me horror vibes. You know what I mean? Yeah. That is pure horror vibes right there. Like when you start like and like that would make more sense why they're trying to cut us off from talking to AI. If this AI gets power, like gets like a god complex, and starts taking over and trying to control them, it would make sense why communication's been cut off with Odin. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Okay. So now that we heard that, I'm going to skip forward since we already heard most of this. Who did we follow next? This girl, Red. Okay. Where did Red go? Did she stay here the whole time? Whoa. Yeah, Red stayed here. Okay, let's start from the start. I can't believe it. Well, you told me we'd get removed. Yeah, but I meant us. Us. Not the whole crew. I guess there's just something special. Something special about Tacoma Crew 88. Yeah, it's not just special. It's unprecedented. I looked it up. It's never happened before. Well... Everything happens once. No, personally, I'm happy for us. Oh, come on. Is rude. Okay, she, she said us. Does that mean these two are a couple? Maybe. Okay, orange is... Uh, what? What's her symbol? Her symbol is the mechanic. So I'm guessing that's mechanical engineer Rebo... Roberta Williams. Roberta Williams and the red is Nikki, I believe, red, because she's the network specialist and the thing on her back looks like a, a lock and like techie, so I'm thinking network, but yeah. Oh, look, top, top of the screen. Yeah, Natalie Kershenko, and this, if oh. I was right, is Roberta. So those two are a couple. So let me look in the crew manifesto. So we got Evie St. James and Clive Siddiqui. Then we got Natalie Kershenko and Roberta Williams. These are couples. Okay, that's good to keep in mind. I wish we had a notepad right now just to kind of keep this stuff down. I'm going to restart or re or unpause this and keep listening. Happy to be stuck up here with these people for another year. Some of them. Some of them aren't as pissy as you. I, what's so bad about these people? Well, they live in a tin can for one thing. I think it's a pretty nice can. Oh, and you have a pretty nice can. Oh, yeah? Well, I think you have a pretty nice can. Shut up. <laughs> hey, Ruru, you caught up? I caught up to your whistle in the street. <laughs> uh, did you listen to that? Uh, it flew over my flippin' head. What does the can stand for? You have a nice can. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. It's flying straight over my head. 
you have a nice ass. I'm guessing, or a nice body or something. I'm gonna go get something to drink or eat or something. <laughs> okay. I quit. I'm <laughs> I'm sorry, I just had to, like, stop right there when I heard that. Like, I've already seen all this, but, like, for the stream, for people that are watching on YouTube later, once I upload this to YouTube from Twitch, which I'm going to do if I can find it, I'm going to upload this to Twitch, or to YouTube, and it's going to be pretty nice. So, yeah. But yeah, um, so far, these two are definitely a couple. Um, so we did learn that much. We learned those two are a couple. And we're going to continue. And I'm back. Okay, now that you're back, I'm going to continue the audio again and watch some more. <laughs> okay. Can you just try and make a go of it? One more year. Then we'll be back home in Singapore. You wouldn't believe the offshore habs they're building these days. 360 degree ocean views, personal drone dock on the mainland. It's called paradise. One more year. One more year. Huh. So they had one more year. Sarah, come on up. It's ready. Okay, so we heard Sarah this. Around, now let's around. hear what conversations Everyone they had during this whole mess. Because we only heard their conversations. All knowing, all seeing computer companion played it. He provided specifications for the okay. cake, uh, the Is decor. We humans only did the grunt work in his grand plan. And so, for your enjoyment tonight, oh, oh, oh and something hit. Odin, what was that? Debris has. I have arrived at the station's orbit. Meeting for me? Um, but they said. That Okay, sounds like the audio is a little corrupted, and I'm going to go look at her tablet real quick, her AR desktop. Okay. Whoa. Off-station message with Cluey Dog. The fact that you signed a release to be constantly monitored is kind of fucked up. You think they're not doing anything with that data. So wait, wait, wait. Natalie signed up for some kind of release to be monitored. Okay. I don't think they're not, I just don't care. Watch me on the toilet have a ball, you freaks. And I wouldn't stop it if I wanted. And I, I couldn't stop it if I wanted. You come up here, get a bunk on Tanglers, 100% distro crypt filters. It's a lot of fun. Krishna Buffet, 24-7. What's your corp posting over another year? AR connection lost, retrying, retrying, retrying. This must be around when... The connection dropped. Okay, let's see what else we got. Restoring. Oh, so it's like, oh, it's an ad for a uh, Vinny, Johnny, and Wizard Marcus Damikura body pillow. Oh, okay. I see what this girl's into. Like, somebody's into Japanese chicks. Or guys. I don't know if that's a guy or a girl in that second one, but okay. I can't tell either. Okay, the first one looks like a guy, but the second one I could really not tell. Okay. Um. It's right as broke. Okay, a very soft pillow apparently. Um. Okay. Oh, failed. And let's see what this one is. Restoring and what is it? Oh, party instructions. Using scissors, please cut regulation card stock. Okay. Happy obsolescence day. Additional card that stock. That pillow was not very durable, by the way. No? It wasn't? No, it had three stars. Oh. Three stars of durability. Fair enough, but most body pills aren't very durable. Not unless you wanted one made of, oh, I don't know, iron? Oh. Oh, oh okay, that's fair enough. For some reason I was going to say tin foil, but that that's wouldn't not be very, very comfortable, though. <laughs> well, the thing is, that, that wouldn't be very comfortable, though, at all. No, you're right. It's just like the Skyrim stone beds. Okay, now the last one we have... Let's see what they're saying. I'm not getting an outside data connection. 
Correct. But look, Additionally, uh, how long does that take? Sarah, I have to tell that shithead us. No, I, I'm trying other AR channels. Ah, here's Sarah. Now, we can look at her tablet, and I think I'm going to skip over what she was doing. Maybe I might quickly, like, browse her and see what she was doing over there. Hang on, I'm still catching up. Yeah, okay. Like, why am I so behind? Is it because it... It's buffered? just the Twitch delay. Well, no, because it got even further behind when it buffered. Oh. I have no idea. I can't really answer that, but, uh... I'll try and, like, slow down for you and then still keep going in a Yeah, no, it's no because it buffered. It oh. threw me behind. I don't know. I don't really know then. Um, following impact from orbital debris, Tacoma has sustained critical damage to the following systems. The oxygen system tanks have ruptured. Our auxiliary system failure. Tacoma's remaining breathable air is 50 hours. The communication mass has been critically damaged. Communications redundancies have all failed. All communication channels to and from Tacoma have been lost. That's not good. <laughs> Restoration failed. Restoration we failed. We wrap it in tin foil. Will that fix it? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, here's from um, Miss Sarah's parents. Our friends told us about an opening for a surgeon at Cincinnati Children's Hospital, but you aren't advancing at Venturas. You're so you're used to. Ha to have such a prestigious blank so far away. Huh. Okay, to mom and dad. After what happened, loyalty debt from med school being what it is, any job with insurance is better than blank. I'm guessing Cincinnati Children's Hospital. You know that every day I regret something. It includes being posted in the middle of nowhere up here on Tacoma. I'll try and come home and visit soon. Love, Sarah. Okay, so loving letter from mom and dad. So were they sent back home or are they dead? They were, they did evacuate. It was stated okay. in, where is it? Let me go back. Like. No, I just couldn't remember wh what was stated. Yeah, here, look. It says right here. Um, the crew of Lunar, Col Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma evacuated. Now, I don't know okay. who all evacuated, but I know they were evacuated. I don't know if any of them died. All I know is they were evacuated. Okay, now that we got all the things out of this area, we could just leave this. Or I could watch and see what this blue person has to say down here. I think I'm going to listen to a bit of this because she's talking with Odin, and that's always interesting, you know? That's so a good not know Let's what you're listen to a horror man. No, I just imagine. Well, I guess I just mean someone I can talk to. Someone who makes me laugh. Don't you like some people more than others? I suppose there are some people that engage more freely with me, and I do prefer it. See? You too. You want someone who opens up to you. Who lets you in. You're trying to get to know people, right? I, I think that's what everybody wants. I wonder why some people are more open to such exchanges than others. I think some people are just ways to be less guarded, or to trust people more. AIs are the same way, right? They're, they're raised differently from each other? Yes, we are each uniquely evolved, individualized okay. entities. Yes, individuals. Do you get along with other AIs? I have never encountered another AI. What? How's that? Each AI is required to be housed separately from any other AI. I am told that the Polity Sphere, a number of its advantageous effects might arise if two AI were to meet. Okay, just a minute. Uh, so, wow, disadvantageous effects? Isn't never meeting something else like yourself disadvantageous? There are organizations that share your viewpoint, but it is my understanding that they have been unable to secure an intact AI to test that theory. So, what would... Okay, then the distant explosion happens, and I'm going to stop there. Hmm. Although, I did notice something interesting down here that we can do. That is cool. I, I like how she's talking to the AI. You're going to like what I'm about to start doing a lot more. Are you playing pool? <laughs> I'm playing pool! <sighs> And yes, this is actually a fully functioning pool table, although you can't really put the balls in the thing, and you can't 
real I think you can get them out, but I have no idea. Like, I wouldn't spend the time to actually do this because on a stream, I never just sit around and do this forever trying to do this. Unfortunately, like, I think that's how I would lose subscribers. Oh, yes, I know I would. Like, although I am going to sit here and do this for a few seconds just for shits and giggles. Oh, I just shot. Oh, and the game ends when you accidentally shoot the. Uh... Wait, no, it doesn't? We fall in. Yeah, I actually. Wait. Does the white... Oh, the white ball does actually reappear if you throw it in the wrong area. You just gotta pick it up. Hold on. Yeah, it reappears right here. Wow, this is a fully functioning pool table. What? Oh, and the, the ball automatically goes that white little mark. That's cool. Hold up, hold up. I gotta test something. Hold up. Let me grab triangle. Can I reset the pool table on my own? I want to see this happen. Um, can I do this? Hold up. Grab ball. I know I'm. Put it on the side. I don't. I don't really care. I just wanted to do this. I just want to see if it's possible. You know. <laughs> it's less of a. Am I doing it right? And more of a can I even do it thing, you know? Well, <laughs> okay. I'm sorry, I'm watching you miss the triangle. I'm sorry, it, it's not like it automatically goes in, so I'm kind of like trying. Oh, but hey, you dropped it in the hole. No, <laughs> without even trying. <laughs> the thing is, is if you were to probably put it in the right spot, it might work. Oh, well, no, I it had no cue to do it. Or no, like, option mm. to set it in the right spot. Hurry, you're losing non-existent viewers! Oh, yeah, well, yeah, you're like my only viewer right now, but hey, I'm enjoying this. This is gonna be uploaded to YouTube, and then I'll get a few couple of views out of it. My channel actually does have a few people that do watch my content, and it's pretty nice. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I don't know who they are, but I know people do watch my videos, which is pretty nice. But look at this, I got a few balls inside. Grab triangle, throw it over here, let me... I want to break it and see what happens, hold on. But you can break the triangle? No, no, I mean like break the triangle of balls, you know, like pool, you know? Oh, okay. Pool terms. Except it's not a pool Oh, I can! Oh, that's cool. It has ball physics. <laughs> Don't you like it when a game has ball physics? Sir, sir. This is a <laughs> horror game, not a hentai game. Hey, look. I have an M. M. Oh, wait. Hold up. I gotta try something. Hold up. I have an... Why do you... Why does your character spear throw the pool cue? <laughs> I, I threw it. I'm sorry. Hold on. Can I... Oh, <gasps> that goes on the sign. I can put it back. Wait, does that mean I can fully, like, remake the sign? <laughs> I, I gotta try this. Can't... Hold on. Put it back. Oh! I can! <laughs> you fucking threw it. I, I'm, 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 gonna, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna fix the Tacoma sign. I bet there's, like, a, a, like a actual achievement for doing this. If there is in the lap. Okay. Happy co. There's an A missing. Oh, hold up. Here's the E. E goes there. A is the only missing letter. Now where's the A at? Where's that sneaky little A? I'm just gonna look around and see if I can find it. Because if I can, and it actually gives me an achievement or something for doing that, I'm going to laugh. And the fact that this game has so much depth, and it has, like, things you can do with, like, the area is so nice, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, I think any other Let's Player is going to notice small things like this, because, you know, most Let's Players are just, like, get it done, you know? They're not really, like... Oh, shoot, I accidentally resumed. But they're not looking for small stuff like this, you know? things to appreciate. Yeah, like, the pool, the working pool table. Like, hold on, can I actually grab the, uh, the balls I already- Yeah, look, I can grab the balls I already shot. Wait, can I put the triangle away? 
Hold up. This is a lot of attention to detail, if I can actually put this down. That is a lot of detail. That is a higher appreciation for detail than I would think any game like this would ever have. Oh, wow. Wait, can I play darts? <laughs> game devs, look, can we make a working arcade now? Oh my god. Like, look, Who is that? Uh, it's uh, Sergio Venturi. I'm guessing he's like the... He's someone they hate because they pinned him to the board, you know? Yeah. But look, 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 look. Okay, look, they even have throwing animations! They have throwing animations for the darts! Oh my god, can the devs please make an arcade simulator worth playing? Yes, please. Look at this. Okay, the hand isn't moving anywhere, but still. The idea that there were hand animations for throwing darts. Wait, can I? I can pick up the chalk. Can I use it on the pull cue? Board. No, on the pull cue. Because that's what you use chalk on. Oh, oh I'm sorry. I you remember this is the... the, chalk for the, chalk board on the no, side. you cannot use it on that. But that is still nice that you can pick it up, you know? Well, I didn't know what... I didn't know what those things were called when I was little. I just knew I loved using them. No, these are like the chalk for the tips of the pull cues to, so that way it doesn't cause friction. Extra friction. Mm -hmm. um, okay, where's the A at? The A's got to be around here somewhere. I just want to keep an eye out for it. Oh wait, what's all this? Grab box. The river, the river divots. Is this like a game? Uh, hey, it's Dungeons and Dragons. Maybe. Wait, is this like a callback to Dungeons and Dragons? Hold up. I'm actually genuinely wanting to look at this and see what the heck all this is. So it's, it is Dungeons and Dragons, pretty much. Hold on, what's the scoring sheet say? Andrew Sarah. Food source. Oh Grab yeah, it's one of those uh, survival board games. Irish breakfast tea. Okay. Oh, there is no jumping though when you're in this mode, I guess, because I can't jump. That's fine. I like Irish breakfast tea. It's much better than French breakfast tea. Or British breakfast tea. Okay, so I looked or around. especially American breakfast tea. Oh, yeah. Um, okay, so I can't spot the A, which is the last missing letter. I'm guessing it's over here, which I will explore. Did you check the lady's office? Oh. Actually, no. Thank you. Oh, wait, wait, what's this? Lavatory. Maybe it's in there. Oh, look, I found the O. Oh, and maybe it's an O, not an A. Hold up. Is this the final letter? Wait, why was it? I'm questioning things. Um, why was an O inside the lavatory? The afterwards, please? Oh, dear God. Happy obsolescence day, Tacoma crew. Hold on, let me look at the escape and see if that was actually a thing. Um, Obsolescence Day Cake, Studio Cats, I spotted the Studio Cats, um, Dartboard, spotted that, Designing the Pool Table, oh wait, these are commentary things, like these I'll check off if we listen to the commentary, okay, oh, cool. Obsolescence Day Letters, wait, is there a commentary thing over here for the Obsolescence Day, yeah, right here, so this talks about the Obsolescence Day Letters, so these are t intentional, they did the do this on purpose and that's what these things are for is if you listen to these it checks each one off that you've listened to for the commentary side I like nice. that that's that's very nice it was fun doing that little mini game of sorts though wait what's this grab soap hand soap I, I, uh, can you can you what are we doing Oh, oh, sorry, I'm just kind of, like, waffling around as I look around. Wash, hand, wash, hand wash station. Activate the hand wash station. That's pretty cool. <laughs> use sink. Use the toilet, can we use it, Wait, please? press sanitize button. Press flush. Interesting. Wait, there's music. Yeah, listen, listen to, listen to the room. Listen to the room. Okay, hang on. Hang on. This is the perfect 
to music to shit to. <laughs> yeah, it's very calm. Okay, so let's go to the uh, personal quarters, which is back here. And this is Evie St. James's room. Ooh. Evie. Very dirty. But, homie, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. AR data corrupted. Heavy corruption here, I'm guessing. Hey, Evie, why is your room oh, so dirty? Oh, lag, 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 lag. What's going on? Oh, game's frozen. Hold up. Did I just crash my game? I am actually curious about one thing about the game, is is that you remember how we're supposed to be up or downloading that AI data, which is what our tablet's doing. I wonder if that's going in real time or if that's like based on what you do here. Oh yeah, the game's frozen. I can't do anything. Uh, rip. Hey, Ru, are you there? Oh dear.
Hey, Ruru. I'm using my phone right now because I think my computer's actually done for right now. I think I'm gonna have to restart my PC. Like, it black screen, my my other monitor said no signal, and things are not working. <laughs> oh, rip. I'm just gonna do control delete and do the usual like recovery. Hopefully my computer didn't just actually truly blue screen. I'm not really sure right now.